to be light, but we've got that big trough that's spinning out there. Temperatures right now, let's show you that if we can. You see temperatures in the 40s have dropped into the 30s now. We're down to 34 degrees in Burlington, 40 degrees still holding on to that in Winston-Salem. You can see temperatures at 29 degrees in Eden and 32 degrees in Yanceyville, so near freezing in many zones, and we expect upper 20s tomorrow morning. Appalachian Ski Mountain, take a look from earlier in the day. You can see there folks are enjoying, yeah, some freshly made snow and some snow that fell, but under a half an inch in most of those areas. Beach Mountain had a little bit more. You can see there downtown Boone also dealing with some wet roadways from rain that mixed in. High Country Light Zone, Phelps Park and Galax mostly dry tonight. And you see beautiful light show thanks to William Bottomley. Your possible snowfall totals though as we look ahead in the mountains as we go into New Year's Day. Under a half an inch is expected. So very light snow may fall. We've got a couple of these areas of energy that are going to roll overhead in the upper levels and bring us a chance to see a little snow. Another system also by middle of the week, Tuesday night into Wednesday morning, or I should say Wednesday night into Thursday morning. So we've got a couple rounds here. So your early morning Monday you might see some snow and then again early Thursday morning might add to that. We could get up to about an inch at that point and maybe adding just a touch more as we go into late Saturday. So we'll be watching for those trends, but it looks very light at this point in terms of snowfall possibilities. That means we're going to stay dry in most areas east of the mountains. You've got temperatures on your Sunday in the 50s sunshine, then followed by clouds as we headed to the midnight hour rain in the new year with temperatures in the upper 30s. You have more clouds that will settle in and those snow chances may build up in the mountains and just the highest peaks in the western slopes look to gain a little bit more snow by early on New Year's Day. Your temperatures on New Year's Day cooler though because we do have that system rolling in to bring us clouds and a slight chance of a passing shower. You look how spotty it is. Our rain chances right now are at about 20%. We'll keep you updated on that. But middle of the week we still have temperatures that are near normal. We should be at about 50 this time of the year. Upper 40s aren't too far from that. Of course it's on the cooler side. You've got 46 degrees today in Greensboro officially 49 in Burlington and we expect more of the same once we get you into Monday. But tomorrow is a nice, sunny, bright day. We just start out with 27 degrees to near 52. Winds are going to stay up out of the southwest at 5 to 10. And in the foothills, calm winds tomorrow morning will keep you cold. 26 degrees. We've got you at 51 for an afternoon high. And in the mountains, it may feel more like the teens at times, thanks to that wind that's going to gust 15 to 20 miles an hour. Eastern slopes a little bit better with the wind, but we still see 10 to 15 throughout the day. Highs near 46. If you're traveling tomorrow, just keep in mind that folks in western Pennsylvania, throughout tomorrow and then western New York might get some snow might be travel trouble there, but most areas across the southeast are dry and just use caution if you're going to be traveling up along 221 and 321 where we did see some snowfall on those western slopes. And of course we look ahead January 6th through the 12th, so that's the second week of January. Slightly above normal chance to see either rain or snow. Our temperatures should be near normal for this time of the year, so doesn't necessarily mean snow. You can take a look at that seven day forecast. We've got your New Year's Eve day looking beautiful. Good sunshine and then more clouds on Monday and then near normal most of the first week of January. We'll have more right after this.